Yo, what's up everyone? Welcome back to the Joshua Plan Golf. Uh, I believe this is the start of the FedEx Cup playoffs, if I'm thinking correctly. So welcome, welcome wherever you're from. Uh, we are playing the FedEx St. Jude Championship at Magna Golf Club. So this should be fun. I haven't played this yet, uh, this course I should say. So um, I'm gonna shoot for that plus two and just keep progressing down a little bit every time. So. We'll see how things go. Um, the last three days, my driver's been a little bit wonky with uh, playing out on the actual course, so we'll see what happens inside here. Let's do this. Gentlemen, my name is John McCarthy, and I'm giving you all of the welcomes for joining us today here at this event brought to you by the TGC Network. And this is the first round of the event, and we are ready to go. Let's get down to that first tee. Thank you, John, for the introduction. Oh, it looks like a nice dog leg right. So, water to the right as well. So, let's just draw one right in there. Just perfect. Had this longest drive yesterday. Opportunity and I literally was 10 yards away from the next person up. So I thought I smoked it and won that, but unfortunately I didn't, so. Oh God, that was terrible. That, I declare this event. <laughs> Don't go in begun. the water if there's water. And he's taking this one through some branches. Well, that's interesting. I can't hit it in that area. Apparently not. This is off to a great start here, guys. That was a, one would say horrendous drive. <laughs> so <clears throat> let's, let's try take two on that. It's not even water over there. That's kind of odd that it's like, can't do that, whatever. I don't know why I couldn't do that the first time, but I didn't yeah, no, move I think it. This one's gonna pan out. I'm gonna be in the fan. Yeah, I figured as much. I never moved it off to the right on that one. Not smart on my part. <laughs> that one pretty solid, I felt like, though. It's got 155. Back of the green. We're gonna go an eight iron. Forgive me guys, I'm gonna have to clean my clubs as I'm going here because I didn't have an opportunity yesterday and I got all kinds of stuff happening today. I mean, uh, this week. I got golfed tonight for league and then I got golfed tomorrow night and then I got golfed Saturday, Sunday. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be a busy week for golf. Golf is name of the game this week all right so we can get it on the green and hopefully one putt for for a bogey nah it didn't come out of there good <clears throat> give me a putt give me a putt Ooh, keep going roll down there i'll take that with that horrendous from swing. 21 feet away That's what we've got here for a first putt of the day. A little bit left on the front part there, but then it just evens out and doesn't do jack squat. So I think it may be right there, 22 footer. Yesterday, I will say it was a four man scramble yesterday and I couldn't miss a putt. I made like four 15 foot putts, it was great. Hammered that. Let's hopefully it stows down. Ooh, and it just misses. All right, double bogey in the first hole. I still can't believe that that was and like starting the day off at out of bounds or not, not out of bounds, but you know. And now let's move to the second hole. 162, 12 feet down. It's not actually been eight iron. 
depending on where the pin is. Oh yeah. We're gonna go a little bit off to the right. Get ourselves an eight iron. 12 feet down too. See if we can put a better swing on than the last one. I've got some making up to do. I need some birdies, y'all. After that first hole. Oh, Maybe left it off to the right on that one. We'll be there. But it's gonna be, oh crap. I guess it wasn't there. I left it That's way off to the right. That's an approach shot. Got ourselves a chip. Yeah, pretty straightforward. Let's get in the circle. God, what the hell, Josh? <sighs> I don't need this right now. That was just a pure, unadulterated shank. Come on, roll down, please roll down. Can't start off double bogey, double bogey on this sucker. <sighs> God, that was a this horrid, a seven horrid footer. chip shot. Wow. Eight foot. All right. Nothing like digging a hole for yourself and having to dig your way out of it. And I didn't hit it hard enough. Oh goodness, that was that was almost it. Wow. All right. And kind of our leader today. Pick yourself up at the bootstraps. A round of four under par. And pull now your let's way see what out. This third hole has in store. Hmm. All right, four birdies. Back to back to back to back. <laughs> Get me back to even par after the next four holes, y'all. Wouldn't that be something else? That would be something else, I tell you. Ah, oh, God, what am I doing? Yeah, I'm not closing not the club pace promising. whatsoever, y'all. Hit the sand, please be in the sand, thank you. Just begging for it to be in the sand of all things. Wow, that was such a horrible swing, you guys. I'm just not closing the face. Everything is just wide freaking open. All right, now this is 15 feet up too. I didn't even see that. I almost done messed that up. Switch this over to a gap wedge instead. Be good. Give me some spin. Spin that sucker back, please. Spin back more. Oh. And this? for the birdie. I didn't spin at all. All right, this birdie start of the uh, four birdies play here. At 14 feet, basically a straight putt, or uh, not uphill, downhill or anything like that. So 14 footer, let's see if we can get this one knocked in. It curved a lot more than I thought. Stop. It curved way more than I thought. Hey, it's a par. And he will move up on the leaderboard after that hole. And now setting up for the next par All right, let's even straighten out this driver. <laughs> My God. 
This is just horrendous, you guys. Gotta close that club face. Gotta get this worked out before this evening with league, and then especially Saturday and Sunday, I'm more excited about. I really wanna play good those two days. That was a good swing. A little high, it's but. It's looking like it's heading into the fairway. That was, a, that was a great swing right there. If I could do that every yeah, single about 115 time, yards I would to be the a pin. happy person. <laughs> oh yeah, that's cool waterfall over there. Getting over my waterfall. That was a good swing. It's coming back. Looking Come on, good. baby, get in the circle. Ah. So a little bit left. This one's right around I'm eight giving feet. myself opportunities, though. Yeah, that last one moved a ton, so I feel like these are moving a little bit more than I think. This one's downhill, too, so I'm gonna basically get it to the cup here. And on my spot right in front of me here. Get in. For the bird. It's one. It's one, y'all. And after that hole, plus three on the day. All right, well, I need a par five. Okay, let's par see five. what the fifth nope. has in store for us. It's a short par four, wow. Let's get another 280 carry drive. That would be money. <clears throat> that was a little funky, but that's gonna be playable from there, even though it's in the rough. It's only gonna have like I doubt he's very happy about that shot. 86, 13 feet up. Out of the rough, I'm going full wedge on here, sand wedge. Yeah, I like that. I'm a little long, it's right in the center. I think this is gonna be just right, quite honestly. Oh, that one I bladed. Sit down. Wow. Yeah, I bladed that one. I hit that 118 yards. Rough, but it was hit from some much <laughs> gnarlier rough. Oh, jeez. I hate it when he gives me an eight iron. Of all the things, why would I ever hit an eight iron on here? I'm never gonna do that. Just stupid. All right, 22 yards. Chip this in for that continuation of the birdie streaks here. Oh, come on. Didn't think I hit it that hard. Wow. About 13 yes, feet I did. away. All right, I need to make this. Fourteen feet uphill. Yeah, not, I don't think this doesn't curve very much, but I've been surprised by some of these putts how much they've curved. So, turn, turn. Oh, Ooh, that that would have been good. Get that a little hard. All right, back to where we were. Dang it. And after that whole curve, we're sitting at four 
over for the Freaking day. Freaking putts right now. And now setting up. Biggest thing like drivers off. Tee off. Just so Ooh. completely off right now. I really have to get some good shots here, guys. Need some, some fairway shots here. Ah, God, I am just not turning anything over. It's just horrendous, you guys. And he's probably not too happy about that Face one. Face is wide open. All right, I like a lob wedge from here. Just want to go over the flag and spin it back. Let's do that. Come back. Um, putting it looks like, as long as it doesn't spin back too much. Hit that one 79 yeah, yards. I am pretty that. sure he's gonna like that. Rough took a little bit and off this that one. For of course. I think this one's gonna be pretty straight because I think it moves a little bit at the beginning, and that's it. And then moves back at the end. It's a 31 footer. Come back, come back, come back. Ooh, it looked close, it just didn't go. Par, yes, pars are okay. And it's six under for our leader today. And setting up. All right, first par four, par five, or five. Par five, I can't even talk today. I just, I just don't know what I'm doing like to not turn over my wrist. And it be right here. Okay. I got this this time. Definitely turned my wrist over on that one. And he can't be pleased with himself after that one. All right, 2.30. All right, better look and see what we got going on here. Be sure there's no water or anything. All right, we got 230, nine feet uphill, out of the rough. So this should be the right club, because I can carry this 230, and rolls out quite a bit, so I need to start it off on a good line as well. Come back, baby. Come well, back, keep on like coming back. Heading to the rough. Well, not a bad leave. that 236 that was not a bad shot I just need a little bit more so a tiny bit more of a draw to it left that out about 10 yards to the right or else that would have been perfect all right we're gonna use a 60 degree here just get over up and over this lip and then stop it on a dime God, that come out, came out weird. What the heck was that? And this putt's for birdie. It was like slow motion. That was so weird looking. A little bit on, just 
just gonna go right out this one. This one ain't moving much, I feel like. All right, 22 feet. All right, turn back, get in there. Yes, dead freaking just center, you guys. A fantastic you bet. from that length. Forget about it. And he's gonna move up in the standings after that hole. And the eighth Ooh. hole is next. We got ourselves a <sighs> old par three. Thinking this one's gonna be seven. We'll find out pretty quickly, I guess. Right in the middle, like a seven iron. Probably, I don't know. I don't think I'll be able to get it there with a eight iron unless I really went at it. it looks Come like back. a seven iron. Come back. Be good. Be good. All right. I didn't hit that club super solid, but it was the right and I think club. He will be pleased with that. The right swing for this that. This one's about 11 feet what from the cup. And another birdie opportunity here. Fourteen footer. Ooh, and it just, just misses. And currently sitting at plus three for the day after that hole. And next up is the par five. Keep those back a little bit at a time. Now give me opportunities for putt birdie putts. One of them is going to drop eventually. Another par five here, too. This one's shorter. That is a little though. So, and just put a good swing on it. Make sure that club is closed. That is a good swing. 2500 spin, 16 degree loft, but that's right, 78 carry. Yeah, I think you'll like that. Okay, and about 205 yards to the pin. That's a pretty inspiring shot just there, hitting this par five green in two definite eagle possibilities. For our leader on the board today, 600 par is their score. And next up is a par four, folks. All right, on the par four, we got a couple of birdies back. We're sitting pretty right now. Spin 
And I doubt he's very happy about that shot. Hmm, I'm not sure what to do with this one, quite honestly. Lob wedge is going to be too much, or not enough. Nice shot. I think you'll like that. Yeah, this putt's for birdie. He's right, John. It is. Pretty straight putt, too. Anything that go a little bit right. These ones are going a little left as well, too. So I really don't think this is going to move all that much. All the hill as well. What do you think? Oh, that was that was very close. I would take that. I mean, that putt. And after that one, plus two for the day. And moving on to the eleventh hole. That was a powerful, powerful drive. A little bit high on the spin. Carried that 282 though. I mean, <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. Where the hell did yeah, about I... a buck 15 to the pin from I here. I heard my, uh... Oh, here it is. Buck 16. And I think you'll like that. Yeah, this one's about 19 Great. feet away. sitting on top of the leaderboard with a round of six under par. And moving along There's now on the 12th finish. hole. This drive's just smoking, folks. stuck behind me, but that worked out okay. Didn't carry very far. But it's not a super long hole, though, either. 
and hitting from 195 yards out. Going with the four iron here. Yeah, baby. Okay, settle down, settle down. <clears throat> I hit that song. That was a right choice. Oh, yeah. Spin back. Come on back for me, baby. Oh, yeah. Keep coming back. Keep coming back. Very well played golf shot. Hitting this par five and two, it's going to set up some serious possibilities. <clears throat> That was gonna go. Dang it, stop right there, please. Then, and he's moving on up on the leaderboard after that hole. And teeing off on this par three. You know what I don't like about these par threes? Every one of them is exactly the same. Every one of them has been like 164 yards. I'm a big fan of that. <clears throat> I like a little bit of different types of par threes. Alright, let's get around the right here, guys. And going with the seven iron on this one. And I think this shot might uh might have a bit too much club. And that couldn't have been the uh, intended result on that approach. Too much club. Heavy rough. I gotta get the chip up. But uh, neither. I was hoping I was on the fringe, but I'm not. Down a little bit too. A little bit left. A little shorty here. Six yards. And after that hole, one over for the day. And now the 14th hole. I think you'll like that. From here, 190 yards to the pin. 190 yards still? Yeah. I'd be closer than that. All right, this is gonna be more of a five-hour type shot here. Not even that, more like. 
like six iron. This button's really dirty. <laughs> I think the last time I used this club, I knocked it on the green. But I was long with it. <laughs> Not today, though. And going with the six iron. A little left, a little short, but that's okay. I'm on into fantastic on work on this par five, hitting the green in two. Just doesn't water. want to drop. Still destroying these part five. My long hair is long today. Gee, money. And moving on to the 15th Ooh, hole. Drivable par four now. I like it. Good swing on this. Don't try to overkill it. What happens here back from around the beach? Here. Every time I turn around, I have to go find the dang thing. <clears throat> All right. Long wedge. I'm thinking this one's going to be like a 35 yard shot. Uphill. That was in. Yeah, this one's going to be a little bit more than I think. And this putt is for Birdie. Yeah, a pretty straight putt, seriously. If anything, it's going to go left. That one's going to bring him down to even par. Right. And we setting up on the 16th tee. Par four. All downhill. Look at that big old fairway to hit into. Oh, don't get the dirt past me. That's soft. 
I think he'll Carried like that. that 284. That was a good swing. 165 ball speed. 92 yards. Sand wedge. Well, you'll probably like that from 18 feet away. Ooh, that looked Come good. On. And that performance will bring him down to even par. Okay, and moving on to the 17th now. with the nine iron. Get on the green, please. A little bit of a putt left, but it's on the green. And he'll be happy with that. And this putt is for Birdie. And after that one, he's going to go down to even par. And final hole, ladies and gentlemen, and he is six strokes off the lead. Let's see what happens. And that shot is back into the fairway, and uh, that green is definitely in play.
in my head. I'm not even kidding, guys. I was thinking that in my freaking head right before I swung. And this putt could save oh, par. God, that was terrible. I was shaking it that freaking bad. Literally thinking in my head. Don't shake it. God, that was crazy. Put a good roll on it, I'll be in the circle either way. So I'll go pace on this one. 38 feet. We'll turn in now. Slow down. Are you freaking kidding me? I didn't even hit it that hard. My God. Ugh, I have to wait till the last hole. And this putt is for bogey. Double bogey on the last hole. Ugh. Really wanted that to be a pretty clean round, and that was not the beginning and the end. Let's get the scorecard here. I mean, I shouldn't be too terribly unhappy about that because I mean, I had an extremely clean card after that first two double bogeys. I mean, double bogey on one and two, dragged myself back with four. Bogey five, and then end up just plus two on the front, and then really good on the back. It's that last double bogey, man. <sighs> Met my goal, though. I mean, can't be too unhappy about it, but. Uh, so, we'll release this video, and then uh, we'll be back again for round two here. Um, tell your friends, share it out. Um, love to get this uh, channel growing a little bit more. We're slowly creeping up, but uh, yeah. Appreciate you guys coming along. Until next time, catch you later. Peace.